Good morning, Lava Bears. Today is Friday the 13th, and it is a white day. This is your last day to purchase a handmade bead bracelet from the Rise Club in the comments before and after school and during lunch. 100% of the proceeds go directly to send a Kenya girl to school. Hey, Lava Bears. You know you don't have to be a senior to be curating your future. Juniors, now is the perfect time to explore all the options you have. Sophomores, are you ready to find that first job to gain some real-world experience? Freshmen, do you want to discuss your strengths and find activities that can can help you make them stronger. The Fu Future Center is here for all of you. Schedule a meetup with Anita or Teresa. It might just be the thing to get something new started. Attention freshmen. Anyone interested in student government next semester, please attend a Wednesday lunch meeting in the library. Again, all freshmen that are interested in making the school better through student leadership, please attend a meeting at lunch January 18th in the library. See you there. Writing Club is meeting today and every Friday at lunch in room S18. We decided to test some students' and teachers' knowledge on world geography. Here's a feature on how it went. Can you name how many countries there are in the world? There are 195 countries. All right, and can you name uh, three of them that have four letters in their name? Uh, Fiji, Iran, and Iraq. All right. Can you tell me where you learned all this geography information? Geography club, of course. Uh, geography club, more than anything, I think is like a social event. It's sort of a gathering, but it's also to teach geography, which I think is sorely lacking in today's curriculums in school. Like, most Americans can't, like, say the general area where most countries are. So, what is the southernmost state in the U.S.? Florida. So, which country has the most deserts? Country, yeah. Australia. Okay. I was gonna say Africa, but I don't know. <laughs> oh, what's the northern northernmost state in the U.S.? The northernmost state. Canton. What's the southernmost state in the U.S.? Southernmost state in the United States. Uh, ooh, a lot of people say Texas, but I think it's Hawaii. All right. Um, what is the country with the most deserts? Oh, country with the most deserts. I'm going to say the United States. All right, all right. My favorite part of the Geography Club is the music. Um, I like the geography games and the competitions we do. Name two countries that have four letters in their name. Two countries with four letters. Asia, A-S-I-A. -A. Countries. 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 Oh, countries. Um, Spain, S-P-A-L, that's five. Oh dear lord. Uh, <laughs> um, uh, countries. Ghana. G-A-N-A. Ghana's a country. G-H-A-N-A. Oh dear lord. Winter formal's coming up. Here's a little more info. Guys, I don't know if I'm gonna go to the winter formal. I don't even have a date. I don't have a date and I'm going. Hey Tosh, did you go to Winter Formal with me? <laughs> I need to buy a guest pass for my date because she doesn't go here, which are due by January 18th. You can come to Miss Debbie's office before school, after school, or during lunch. And you can pay with $20 without ASB or $15 with ASB. Um, I'm here to buy my ticket. There's actually no tickets sold at the door. <laughs> but no one ever told us that. Um, actually we did. It's on the video announcements. Now, here's Deep Thoughts with Mr. Lockwood about emotions. And now, Deep Thoughts by Jack Hanks. Jesse Lockwood. It takes a big man to cry, but it takes a bigger man to laugh at that man. Have a great weekend, Lava Bears, and stay classy, Ben High.